Luke is on musket wars. Well, back when the Maori were fighting between the tribes, they needed more weapons to have an advantage to take over their land. So when the British came, they needed to trade with them to get more weapons. And uh, here's a picture of a tire heart I used to use. Uh, it didn't come out correctly. So well, when the British came to New Zealand, the Mali wanted some muskets, so they traded land for muskets, battles against the other tribes. When the Maori got the musket, they fought between the British after they got their musket because that some of the some of the other tribes thought it wasn't fair, so they were going to fight for their land even against the British just because they wanted their land back. Uh, tens of thousands of Māori died in the musket wars of the 1810s and 1820s and the 1830s. Muskets changed the face of warfare, declaiming the population of some tribes and shifting the boundaries of some areas that others controlled. Between 1818 and the early 1830s, 20,000 Māori were killed in, in what has been, been described as the musket wars. Thousands more were enslaved or became refugees. Um, an overview of New Zealand wars, also known as the Wars of anglo maori Wars. The start of the musket wars is distributed 